Hello! And uh, I've decided to not use my wide angle lens with this camera because first off, uh, I like it on autofocus because, uh, no, that hurts. But I find when I have my glasses on, I can't have the headband on because then it's just like, you know, too many focus points. That's why I never wore headbands because they always drove me crazy because they interfere with the glasses. But my child has my phone, which I do need, but uh, I felt like filming a video with you guys. We are uh, just, you know, we're gonna play. We're gonna have fun, we're gonna play and we're gonna put makeup on our face. Uh, I'm, other than to potentially take photos, I don't think I'll use the wide angle lens because I can't have it on autofocus, which is super helpful for <coughs> this whole setup. But uh, I don't want to have the autofocus because it just, it gets annoying because you can hear it autofocusing like every five seconds, unlike with this lens. Plus, this lens actually like can zoom in and out better. <sighs> Do not mind me. I am just a very pregnant lady that's feeling like shit. So, um, my nails are nice and trimmed, so I think I might paint them today. That'd be nice. We should paint them. Um, I wanted to do something for Valentine's, like a cute little moment for Valentine's. Oh my gosh. Uh, Oh. Uh. <laughs> I go over and uh, <laughs> ah, I turtled. It's not good. <laughs> Tur turtling is like a thing that can happen quite frequently. So we have this shade, which would look rather cute. Very Valentine's. It's called Berry Naughty. Are you a Berry Naughty girl? I don't know, sir. Okay. Um, and then I had like other. Oh, look, I have a tiny little puff. Huh? I had these newer ones that I got from work that I thought would be. Valentine's jeans. Can I find them? No. Um, do I have to like lean over into the depths? Okay, so, oh, what the fluff? What was that? I touched something in my nail polish thing and now I have, oh, now you won't focus, see? Blah, focus. Now I have like shiny stuff all over my hands. What? That's messed up. Hi! There we go. Thank you. Okay, so... Oh, 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 no. Uno momento. Alright, so 
uh, oh, I must have left this on for two, oh no. Um, so I had a bit of a shower and uh, cleaned up some laundry, did some things. I am definitely having a I feel like poop day. <laughs> uh, put on some clothes because I always find when you get dressed and you do that kind of thing, it really just helps set the mood. But my brain is also like I want to do nothing. I'm just letting my lotion kind of like settle into my face and then I think I'm going to play. Uh, I wanted to do uh, more of a Valentine's y look. I was going to use this palette, which is mostly just a whole crap ton of pinks and stuff because uh, it's the rose and play, <sighs> which will just be cute and really nice. And I do want to paint my nails, but I'm kind of like, I don't know if I'm going to. Instead of doing the lipstick I used yesterday, I was going to do like a combo of these two. Because, you know, tomorrow, frick, tomorrow is Valentine's Day. And I don't have any Valentine's for my monster. Oh, no. I have some time to get <laughs> to Valentine's Day. It's Tuesday. Valentine's Day is Tuesday. So, it's okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> my brain is just not in my head. So. Yeah. I'm just gonna watch some YouTube and uh, back with you when this is a little more ready for the monk cup. All right, so I primed and prepped my face. I used the no longer existing uh, primed and peachy cool matting from Too Faced, which I absolutely love. It's strictly just because of the smell of it. But um, they do have, like you can get other better mattifying primers. And again, we're just kind of playing with our makeup, whatever, because why? I can, and I have nowhere to go, nothing to do, and I just <coughs> want to put makeup on my face, because who sometimes doesn't? Doesn't matter if you have anywhere to go, makes you feel better. Let's do it. Waiting. Hi, little one. What's up? I'm telling mom about this the cool truck. Who are you telling about the cool truck? Mom. Mm-hmm. I, I wanted to make a video of, to, of Borderlands 3 on Atlas. Oh, so you're telling the Atlas people about it? Yeah. No, yeah. I'm talking about the real pe I'm talking to the real people. Which real people? The ones on Earth. Oh. Humans. Humans. Of what? What are people called? Of these cool cars. They show them what the cool cars are. Yeah. Yeah. So. This uh, foundation is clearly almost dead, as well as is my battery. So, we should probably do is get the charge bank on because this is my one of my spare batteries. Maybe this is my camera. It eats batteries. <gasps> do I have a battery eater? Anyway, just spritzing down my sponge. Probably just go until my camera dies and then I might change the battery. So that's like two batteries that I have to charge. I got this little spritzer, which is like so good for hair and uh, 
dampening my sponges, which is awesome. I will be so glad when this baby comes out. At the same time, I don't know. I just, I am so scared. So, so scared. Why? Because it does not matter if I know what I'm doing, like, this time around. I know what I'm doing. Uh, firstly, it's a girl. So, I have technically no idea. Mommy? It's a completely different person. Oh, you do? Did you upload my character? Did you upload my character? No. Okay. Good. Okay, thank you. I wish I had clips down here. I, th I need to get more like hair clips for this room because I have them upstairs. But I do a lot of my um, hair stuff. I definitely do feel like, <clears throat> so I am in my second trimester and I am definitely feeling the, I am pregnant for far too long. Actually, it's not far too long, but you know, it's just, it is what it is pregnant. I am, oh, 28 weeks. All right, so uh, my child who will never stop talking to me, which I also go, I never want you to stop talking to me. I love that you talk to me endlessly and continuously and again and again and again. And, and mommy, oh mommy, did you know this? Mommy, did you know that? <sighs> I love you too, baby. But anyway, we were talking about uh, so I am officially in my third trimester, and I am 28 weeks. So, yay. That's, that's really good. In a lot of ways, once we hit the 30-week mark, we're doing pretty good. Uh, we want to get out of, like, I don't want her to be born super early like her brother was. Like, he was three weeks early, and uh, it's kind of scary. Like, he was just considered term, because I think I was 37 weeks, so, which is officially, I'm getting close to the mark where my doctor is probably going to be monitoring me a little more closely considering how Calvin went down and uh you know that's what I tend to do well that's what my body tends to do and my body's like hey look <laughs> look we're done with these shenanigans which I go yeah yeah no for sure or maybe because you know every baby's like dude I have my own time schedule Thank you for your concern, but I will be uh, addressing my own birth here. <laughs> I choose. Yeah, you choose. Okay. Thank you. Please no. Stay in just a little bit longer. I don't know. Uh, we want a fully grown, fully developed. Yeah. I would prefer not a premature baby. I would prefer not a premature baby. Thank you. Okay, so I should probably do some take it a towel kiss and do the wow kiss of the take it a towel kiss, which is pretty much what I'm doing here, which is hi. I'm just putting makeup on my face. Hee hee ha ha. Um, I do like the QO Beauty 
Uh, it's nice. It's a shopper's brand. <coughs> and it is quite... I love how I say quite. <laughs> it is lovely. I'm kind of thinking these tubes are dead. Uh, I should get rid of them because I'm... Whoa! That made an interesting sound. And I am struggling to get product out of the tube. So, um, okay, uh, and then I love the Candid. Ooh, I really want to try the Candid foundation because it seems, uh, I love the concealer. And I do, for the inner corner of my eye, just like that much as you guys know uh for the inner corner of my eye i do banana which is a little yellow which is nice now there is the trick that you can do which is actually like super valid mixing the pinker shades with the yellow and it really will cancel out those darkness on the under eyes probably good for around the nose too um but I'm just here to make this skin look, like, skinny. <laughs> we like skin like skin. You want skin that looks like your skin, because we're not chameleons. Though, I always love to say, at the end of the day, when it's time to go to bed, I'm going to go and take my face off now. Also, I'm wondering if next weekend I should do, I can do it on Tuesday because I work tomorrow and then I could do the video I want to do with Calvin, which is five-year-old does my makeup because we did the two-year-old and what's really funny was I have such a different setup from when I first started this whole shindig in this house and I have like my own whole dedicated like room you could almost call it a studio space so which is ow smack myself uh, and then I'm gonna go in with the clearly brighter uh, the Garnier now what's nice is you can use this like because it's, it's a concealer, but it's not really a concealer. It's kind of like skincare amped up to, you know, it's skincare without being skincare, which is what we all want. And which is where makeup's kind of turning. Like, <clears throat> more and more you're finding, uh, I'm finding some really nice uh, skincare aspects in uh, foundations and concealers. Like with this one, there's uh, caffeine in it, so it's the anti-dark circle eye ruler. Plus, it has that metal roller ball, which is cooling. Uh, so amazing for a pickup on the under eye. You know what I could do? I could just cut this open because it's plastic and like scoop it out or something. But then I'm like, I'm not there yet. I'm not there yet. I ate some noodles a little bit before I started this and I am so tempted to go back to those noodles after I'm done. I just straight up, when I made the noodles, put them in a container to store in the fridge because, yeah. <clears throat> I am also just so not feeling myself today. <laughs> Though, joke, <laughs> when am I feeling myself right now? And then we just do powdering on the under eye because it evens her out. 
and sets it and prevents like too much fallout. Now I have, and we all, like let's, let's face it, your skin just starts to, as you get older, starts to, we have lines and facial and texture and different things like that. So like, don't be shocked by lines on your face. You're human. It's okay. Um, but I have really creasy, liney under eyes. Um, uh, or I guess you could say like saggy under eyes. <laughs> Not gonna go there. <laughs> Son of a me. Uh, really saggy under eyes. And so, oh, hi. No, thank you. Bye. So because I have that, I tend to like to powder my under eye and I find powdering my under eye works uh, really well for me. So, yeah. Okay. So I go in with like my little powder mixture, which has some little dazzling, like a little bit of sparkle in it, like nothing too heavy just feels like it brightens the under eye and as you can see it looks so much brighter which is nice I think I want to bring this up maybe a smidge I do hmm hmm <clears throat> constantly constantly figuring out this base. I'm just going to be using the one size powder. Not in my under eye today. I I don't know if I liked it there. But I'm going to use it over the rest of my face to give it a real good go and see how much I like it because she's like new to me I wish I had a little bit I wish I had the bigger one because you know well she's kind of tiny Yes. Mm-hmm. You keep telling me that you keep building a gyroscope for me. Hi. So, are you wanting to do my makeup on uh, the camera again someday? Soon? Yeah. Yeah. You? But not today. No, not today. I know. Wait, what are these? Nail polishes. Ooh, can I do your nails? Um, uh, you can yay or nay the colors because that's what I wanted to paint my nails. I'm not going to let you paint my nails. Thank you. Can I, I paint my own nails? Um, you can't. If you paint your nails, you have to turn off the game. And we'll just show because I don't want you touching anything else once you have nail polish on because Polly. I don't want it all over the place. Love you, mommy. Love you. Bye. 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 Motherhood. <sighs> so much fun. No.
also have a brush the pet around my face a little bit. Get all over my desk. They just don't leave you alone. They just don't. They don't know how And you know what? Doesn't matter how old they get, they will need you for the rest of life. So, like with tattoos, it's an extreme commitment. So, you're not committed to taking care of a tiny creature and guiding them don't don't do it don't do it like I love him and I'm so happy I made this choice but it's chaos all right so my setting spray because I like to set at this stage and then I set again at like a later stage. <laughs> All right, so here we are with the eye look. <clears throat> I did this all over the all over the lid, which is just a really nice all over pink, so it gives you a really cute pink base. And then we went in with this more burgundy ish shade so that it deepens up the crease really nice while still giving it that very purpley, pinky, blushy kind of feel. And I always do those with like a big old fluff brush, and then this for the crease because it works really well and then for any like shimmery shade I like to just go in with my ring finger and dab it on because honestly I find you get best like glittery payout as you can kind of tell just works better our fingers are excellent tools my hands are totally clean uh you know <clears throat> And we just go in with like clean hands because, you know, prevents the bacteria. And if you have acne prone skin, built up of the causing of acne. And then I just like to go in back and forth, placing, blending, placing, blending until I have like, you know, a decent I like how it looks now this shade that I'm using which is uh, this one right here come on this one right here for the inner corner is really interesting because it's got like a pinkish glitter to it it's like a bronzy shade but it has like a little bit of pink to it which is like super cute and just adds to that whole Valentine'sy blushy kind of look. So works really well. And then we're going to which one was it that I used? I think it was uh, this one or that one. Both would be absolutely excellent for I'm just gonna pop it of course I did a little bit on the lower lash with the darker shade and what we can do also to brighten up the eye and kind of finish it out go in with a brush kind of like this and just pat it into your shimmery shade and uh, drag it across that lower lash line as you can see it gives it kind of just a little bit of difference 
But then, you know, we also run the risk of... I got a shadow in my eye! Ah. <laughs> but then, you know what? That is makeup life. Honestly. Can't stand shit in the eye. Don't do your makeup. I unfortunately have a lot of opinions of, if you can't stand this, you know, it's kind of like this statement of, you know, unpopular opinion. My unpopular opinion, probably. But, uh, hands down, if you can't, like they say about the kitchen, if you can't stand the heat, get out of the kitchen. And I'm sorry, but, you know, working with makeup is not always pretty. It is meant to be, hmm, not sure which one I like better, the lower or the higher one. And you can't see that with my lighting. You know, we're getting somewhere. Gotta tell ya, my lighting's probably a million times better than it used to be. <laughs> okay, you know what? Let's do an eeny, meeny, miny, eeny, meeny, miny, All right. And then again, just with my ring finger, I dab in. Sometimes I'll actually also go in with my pinky, which is so much more smaller. So much more smaller. Yes, that's English. Ha! Okay, so much smaller uh, and feels a little more precision-y. I speak English words well. So much more, it's more precise. And so I can get a bit of a better base kind of going on. Mm -hmm. And then I like how it just gives a little bit of, you know, brightness to the inner eye without looking too horribly overwhelmed. And it just feels like you know, really put together. Ta-da, and then what we are also going to do, yes, I want this one. We're gonna go dab dab till she looks fab in that color and brush it along the brow bone. Give it, you won't catch me, Kappa. This is the sounds of the next door and you're watching cop shows. <laughs> I keep playing with my inner cheek because I bit it two days ago, three days ago. I don't know. Um, and it's, uh, yeah, it just feels funny. And so the sensory of it keeps bugging me. And so I play with it, which I shouldn't, but I do. <laughs> But here comes, uh, no. Oh, I think he's going to the bathroom. Good. <clears throat> he needs to be better about that. Okay, and then we're going to go in with our e.l.f. primer. No. It's not a primer. It's a bronzer. Take my vocal license. I legitimately... Uh, should just stop talking. Oh, right. Also, I was gonna go in with this liner, which is more of like a plummy color. It's like a burgundy plummy color because we're staying in the purples and the pinks range. Because as I said earlier in the video, Valentine's Day is tomorrow. <laughs> Only if you're special, which, you know, I'm not gonna lie. Right now I feel like super special. Oh, God. Ugh. Like, my brain does not exist in my head. I gotta go out and get another, gotta go preliminary bucket shopping through the baby, bucket seat shopping, because Calvin is five. 
I don't think we should probably stick with the bucket seat we have. Cause like my brain goes, no, Tasha, it's five years old. By the looks of it, uh, it's likely expired. So it's your child's safety. It's a newborn. Yeah. Safety regulations. If we get in an accident, like, you know, my precious little nuggets, they're the most important, beyond my husband, thing to me, and God forbid something happened to them. <sighs> but I just, I don't want to have to spend the money on it. Welcome to adulthood. Choices that we have to make. Expenses that are just so effing expensive that we go, why? <laughs> and my son keeps running around going, number three, number three. We're gonna have three, mom. We're gonna have three. Were you gonna have the third one? Because I ain't doing it. Is it your makeup? What about my makeup? Is it that it looks already done? Okay. Oh, you're sure? I'm sure, I'm sure. You always do this to me. Mommy, it's done. No, it's not. How? I still have to put mascara on, uh, lipstick. You don't need lipstick. I don't need lipstick. You just ah, want me. Oh, that's just kidding. I'll put on the purple lipstick. You just want me to come out and spend time with you. Be honest. Nobody be angry. You're going to go with purple. Actually, I was going to try and mix the pink and the purple. Oh! Good idea, mm -hmm. try mixing pink and purple. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Can I help you, sir? Why sir. don't you just try mixing purple, pink, and blue? No, because it's a Valentine's look. Valentine's I love you. By the way, is today Valentine's Day? No. Mommy? You, sir. <laughs> Goodbye. All right. So here she is. All done. Went in with the freckles that honestly you probably can't even notice on camera, but I can see it. Uh, I absolutely love the color pops. Um, a freckle pen great for getting precise freckles you can do it one of two ways if you're really really light-handed you'll get very small subtle almost imperceptible freckles if you're a little heavier handed you're gonna get like more noticeable thicker like chunky freckles but just take your time do small incremental uh, layers patting it out as you go like dabbing it out as you go with your finger just blending it out um i really really love how this lip turned out she's cute yeah yeah she is i did a little bit of like a rounded look for my lip uh i've been enjoying that every now and again what i do is i just like smile like this and then like that and just connect my two, my cupid's bow. It creates that smoothness so that I have more of like a roundy lip. So I'm gonna go in with, oh, it's a mattifying one too. I'm gonna go in with the NYX Dewy setting spray to finish my face off. I just did a brown mascara because it's cute. I feel like the eyes and the lips say everything, which is what it's supposed to do. So, let's give it a shake. And there we have it. I'm feeling cute, put together, so lovely. I keep looking in the viewfinder. It's gonna be a problem. I have a problem. Okay, uh, 
and I am ready. Feeling put together. Super cute. <clears throat> With a runny nose. But it's, you know, that like literally does not feel different right now. Uh, everything just feels, yep. Yeah. Uh, my hair is definitely like fresh out of the shower, like. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I like when I feel cute. Even though I don't. Like, yeah. I hope you guys are having a wonderful, fantastic day. I got purple on my tooth. I love you. Even though currently I may not love myself. <laughs> um, but, you know, it's a constant work in progress. Um, yeah, I hope you're having a fantastic, amazing, wonderful day wherever you are. Know that you are fantastic, amazing, and wonderful, and just, yeah, try something new every day, and we'll see you all again at some point. Bye! Mwah.